Welcome, my fellow Cerulians. Today is part two of the Air Up review. Hi, everyone. <clears throat> so I did address the fact that I was going to sell the bottle because I was so disappointed. But you t seem to have a very good um, experience with it. Tell the viewers a little bit about that. Well, um, with the Air Up bottle, to be fair, it's not something I would go out of my way to buy. When he gave me the Aero bottle, I did try some of the flavours that it came with and it's been really enjoyable. I can, I can actually get a sense of the flavours. I don't want to say taste because it's not a thing where you taste the flavour. You more sense it, you know, obviously you breathe it in and it hits certain um, things within your your sinuses sinuses i would say <laughs> um so it's a really weird concept but you know because i'm quite aware of smell as it is i i do have a strong sense of smell even in general um i could smell it straight away you know so even sometimes where you don't pull the flavor up i can still get a whiff of it and then when i do pull the flavor up it's more intense for me. I've tried a couple of the flavors. I'm quite slow in getting through all of them because naturally I'm the kind of person that drinks water anyway. So, and that's why I said I wouldn't have gone out of my way to buy the air bottle because I had a plastic water bottle that I was using before Riley gave me the air up and it just did the job. You know, I drink water, so I wouldn't need something that's going to kind of make me drink more water in a way yeah. but i do have to say i have enjoyed it and i feel like one of the best features of this air up bottle is the fact that it keeps your water cool this air up bottle because it's a, is it aluminium or i think it's still still um it keeps the water very cool very fresh i can even like go upstairs at night take it with me and I'm still enjoying fresh water. You know, when I get thirsty in the middle of the night, in the morning, it's still fresh and refreshing. And I like the way the bottle looks as well. It's, you know, quite portable. It's easy to carry on my journeys, um, doing nursery drop-offs. I can take it with me. It's been nice. I've had a really great experience using it. Well, that's interesting what you, some of the features that you mentioned because like yeah i think the design of the bottle is is good the reason why i did go for the more expensive uh bottle the steel bottle was the fact that i like the concept of a chilled drink but having said that the main feature is the flavor as i said in the initial review i do get a sense of the taste or the aroma whatever you want to call it but i just think it's so weak that it's it's a gimmick in my humble opinion, I don't think it's really worthwhile getting. And the only reason why I'm doing this video, a few reasons actually, I'm seeing in the comments, a lot of people saying things like, oh, you was tilting the bottle, you wasn't doing it properly. Well, it was an unboxing review, right? And it was the first time me using it. So naturally I will tilt, but then I did correct myself and hold it upright and drink out of it. So for those who are saying that, oh, I, I tilted it, that's why I wasn't getting a flavor. Well, let me tell you, I was getting a flavour. Another issue people were saying is that I'm not inserting the straw properly. I don't know where they're getting that from because I made it clear as day that I was inserting the straw properly. The fact that maybe the plastic bowl is more effective than the steel. I don't know how you'd come to that conclusion, but we're going to debunk that today. You can see that I've got <laughs> another bottle here, a plastic one. Um, I, I already know, I'm, I'm pretty sure that this is not going to be to my satisfaction but i'm doing this anyway because like i said i want to address these issues and number two the, the, the original video has done extremely well so much so that it's actually paid for the, the original bottle and uh, and then some so you know i'm not at a loss getting this so hopefully this video will do similar similar views uh have a similar sort of impact and actually give you guys more clarity and this time it's going to be more balanced because obviously you're going to get my take on it you're going to get her take on it and also i noticed that some people are saying different flavors have different mm. strengths 
So I want to I want to actually experience that because in the original review, I think I only tried two or three flavors. Yeah, that's what I was thinking because you tried a few flavors and you said that for you it was weak. Very now, weak. For me, very weak. all the flavors that I have tried that came with the original Air Up has been in, like I felt it. You know, I've smelt it, tasted it somewhat. So for me, it hasn't been weak, but I see that you've bought new flavours, so it could actually be, you know, the, the different flavours itself. So it's, it is a good idea trying the flavours and seeing now if there's a difference between what you experienced before, compare it to now, and also I'm here as well to sample some of these new flavours. Okay. So. Before we dig in, I just, I, just want, I just want to add this, guys, yeah? She claims that she enjoys the bottle so well, I mean, she did say that it's taken a while. It's taken a long <laughs> while. Guys, look, this is the five edition and we still have... Another thing. Do you we know... still have five here. <laughs> Do like, you know what it is We've barely gone me? through them. Do you know what it is And they're me? nearly expiring. The only thing I would say with me and the Air Up, because I transitioned from an old water bottle where I would just click it, it would literally pop the sprout out and I would sip the water. But for me, it's been the fact that I have to do an additional step. I'm gonna open this and I'm gonna wash the bottle. Okay. Because my mom taught me better than that. While I do that, I guess you can just help yourself okay. with whatever water and we'll go through them one by one. So, bam. That's what it says on the box. Bam. Bam. Oh. You know, I can smell it from here. You can. I can smell the coconut from here. Wow. I don't have to bring it near me. I can smell it. But that doesn't really excite me because in the original review, I could smell them. They were very strong. Mm. And yet they were very weak when I when I actually drank them. So strange. So I've just popped on the coconut pod. It's called sweet coconut. Not sure if I like that flavour, but then again, I'm not a coconut person, so it is strong though. If you're into your coconut, this flavour's for you. Like it's a very strong sense of coconutty water. Bottle, whatever you call this thing, it's lid <laughs> and uh, straw. Now, so you guys won't say, oh, he's not doing it properly. You can see the teardrop here. I don't know if you can see from there, but we've got the teardrop. And this is shaped such that it goes in that way. And you push it until there's resistance. So you can see I've inserted it properly, okay? I've inserted it properly. Push that in like that. That's how that works. So. Where's the coconut pod? Here, take it from here. All right, let me pour some water in here. This is sparkling water, by the way. Sparkling water. All right, so a little bit in there. Let me put that in. Yeah, so you can see I am placing it like so, where the teardrop is, pushing it all the way down, right? Pushing it all the way down, then pushing it back up to activate. It's up now. So please don't tell me that I haven't been doing that. <laughs> and now I am not going to tilt the bottle. I'm going to keep it like that and sip. Weak. And it doesn't taste like coconut. It tastes like something very chemical. You call this strong. For me, it's strong. I can. That is not strong. <laughs> You're tilting it. They're gonna, they're gonna get at you. You're tilting it. <laughs> I'm just not enjoying it, but I can clearly taste something and smell something. I can taste something, and that something is a, is a, is a, is a hint of chemical weakness. That's what I can taste. It's terrible. Strawberry lemongrass. It looks like you've opened this one already. 
Yeah, I've had this one. So this is one of the old ones. This is one of the old ones. Yeah. And it expires in December 2023. So that's something that um, AirUp don't mm. tell you. But these pods yeah. actually expire. And you didn't tell me when you gave me the pods. That... I didn't know. I didn't, yeah. I didn't actually know. So I, have um, no, I had no idea they had an expiry date. But it kind of makes sense because it's scented. So, yeah, over, so time, over time, it's going to wear out. Okay. It smells like a... Yeah, I can smell, I can I can smell, smell lemon now. and I can smell strawberry. Again, I'm pushing it down, guys. <laughs> and I'm pushing it back up, okay? Please don't tell me I've not activated the pod. I've activated the pod. Please activate the pod. I can see. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> I'm not tilting it. All right, you know what? I'm not going to do this anymore because we'll just be here all day. This one's even weaker. It's like way, way back in the background. Way, way to be fair, background. this one has been opened, so you are tilting the bottle. Just, just letting the viewers know that you are tilting it, and yet you can still taste it very clearly. So, what I'm thinking here is it depends on the person, I think, because we all have very different, but just like how you can smell it, I yeah, can, I you can, can smell, smell it. it. So, I don't know why the flip the the scent and flavour isn't coming through for you. Okay. Let's do a swap. Okay. And let's try lemon. In the, on the website, it actually grades like different, um, different intensities for the different flavours or oh, like which ones are okay. more popular. And I remember that the lemon was one of the more popular mm, ones. Okay. Right. Let's go through this. We're just firing through all of these because, uh, yeah, just trying to find out. I really did enjoy the strawberry lemongrass one, actually. What, just now? Mm-hmm. Really? Mm. Interested. I can smell it from here. I'm not getting the lemon. But you can smell the lemon, right? Yeah, it smells like lemon sherbet. Is this inserted properly? In case people... It's not. It's not inserted properly. I can still taste it. You haven't inserted this properly it's not pushed all the way okay that's fine try it again try again okay i'm getting a very tiny tiny hit like if i had to grade it on a percentile i'd give it five percent out of a hundred percent let me try it on this five one five percent five percent really? it's just way in the background i don't understand I think your nose is broken. No, my nose is not broken because <laughs> clearly I can smell the lemon sherbet. Okay, that's funny. Can you taste it now? I can taste it a bit more now. Hmm. 20%. Okay. We're getting somewhere. But I can taste it more. I think this has been the strongest. You're tilting it. This has been the strongest. But regardless if I straighten it or tilt it, I'm still getting the flavour. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. But I think that's the strongest flavour I've tasted so far. That's very strong. Would you agree? I agree. That's very strong. Okay, so the lemon... That kind of hits you. The lemon The lemon is... Um, even though I still think it's weak, but it is the strongest. It's it the strongest, but it's not the most exciting, to be honest. Okay. I still prefer the um, strawberry lemongrass. Okay. I think lemon has been my favourite, even though it's been extremely weak, but we move on. Okay, winter apple. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of, like, uh, Chris Christmas. Not, not even, yeah, Christmas. Like, like um, when you go to the, mm. to, the, to the fair and you get the, um, what's those, uh, mulled wine? Right, yeah. Yeah, it reminds me of mulled wine. It's a nice, nice smell. You can't. Like, that is, I can taste something, mm -hmm. but it's just, it's just, it's Guys, I'm not even capping. When I tell you these flavours are strong to me, they are strong. Like, I can fully... Are you capping? No, I'm so, not. So when you say it's strong, right? It's strong. As soon as I, as soon as I sip the water, obviously I know it's not, a, it's not a taste because when you taste something, your tongue is immersed in it, mm. but my my nasal senses, they're very heightened. I can smell it properly, like it's intense. 
and then it creates, it's almost trying to deceive my brain, but my brain is too smart. Well, are you breathing? No, not, that's impossible. You can't breathe while you're just drinking. But I still have to breathe. I'm still breathing. It's not like I stop breathing and drink. I'm still, otherwise I'll die. I'm still, I'm still breathing. No, 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 no. It's impossible to breathe while you're, while, while you're drinking at the same time. You can't do that. It's impossible. Try it. Okay. You, you can't breathe through your nose while you're sucking through a straw. It's impossible. It's, it's Look, actually impossible. If you can do it, you're an alien. You can't do it. I'm going to put it on my... All right, I'm going to try the peach it. now. The peach tastes very peachy. Can you taste it? I can taste the peach, but I'd, I'd, I'd give it like 15%. It's the second strongest I've tasted so far after the lemon. So lemon, peach. Interesting. Yeah, we're just firing through. So we've got four more. I like the peach. It is strong. I really like the flavour. Cola, virgin mojito, wild berry an orange vanilla swirl. Apparently this is, people going crazy for this really? one. Really? Yeah, so let, let's, just, let's not waste time. Let's just go for it. I think this says... Love a bit of swirl. No, this smells weird. It smells like when you're in the sweet shop, you know the pick and mix section, and you've got like all the sweets just... No, I don't know about ...coming that. together. I don't know about this one. It might You might be pleasantly surprised. I doubt it, because, like, look look how many we've gone through, and I'm not impressed. I don't have a problem. I'm impressed. No? No. So, is it is it still very weak to it's you? It's very weak. Oh, very, yeah. very That's weak. That's something wrong. Mm. It tastes like candy. I can see why people like this. It's got like a candy, kind of orangey vanilla scent to it. It's nice. I like it. I like Seriously? it. But my favorite is still the winter apple for me. Strawberry lemongrass and the peach. No, this is not. I it. don't think the air ups for you. This is not it. Right. We've got three more. Which one should we go for? Um, I'm curious about the virgin mojito. Virgin mojito? Mm -hmm. Okay. If you're using up all my water, it's time for you to use your own bottle. Okay, let's do it. Mmm, minty. I just think it's weird that you can smell it. But when it comes to getting the sensation, drinking it, it's so weak for you. It's weak. I get it, like, but it's what? weak. This one's confusing me. It's like I get it, and then it's gone. Mm. It's it's way in the background too. I think so far, it's lemon and peach have been the ones that have st that stood out, but yet they're still very weak. I knew I knew I wouldn't be impressed by all of this. I like this, but it it can get a bit too artificial after a while. But it's an interesting flavor. I feel like if you're into your mojitos, you might appreciate this. I think we should save cola till last. Okay. Wow, well, berry. We're going through all the flavors. Yes, How many we have we gone through so far? Okay, so we've done seven already. So this yeah. is going to be the eighth one. This exercise has already confirmed to me that this is a gimmick. It's a joke. You can't say it's a gimmick if it's working for me. <laughs> so how is it a gimmick? All right. Is it is it stronger than 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 a cordial? It's very weird to explain because when you have a cordial, that's an actual that's an actual flavor. You get a flavor profile, but when you when you have the air up, it's a sense. It's um sensory nose yes. breathing thing going on, which I can clearly get the I get the hit. Obviously, Obviously, my brain knows that it's not a flavour. Yeah. So I think, for me, I wouldn't go out of my way to buy an air up because I'm either going to drink water or I'm either right, going to drink me, a let cordial. Me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Mm. Once, once, you've, 
once you've taken a lifetime to go through these pods, because you, you, <laughs> you, you, you take your time. Once yeah. you've gone through all of them, mm-hmm. answer me this. Are you going to buy another pod? No. But Case closed. I'm not going to buy another Case closed. one. Because, not because I don't appreciate the sense and the sensory thing going on. It's just because, personally, for Cap. me, Cap. I drink water anyway. I don't have any issues drinking Cap. water. Cap. So and why do you buy cordials? Because I get bored of water. Exactly. So, so this is supposed to make you not be bored of water. So why wouldn't you buy the pods? Because I just they, don't think it's worth the money. No, it's nothing it's, to it's do not with... That strong, if someone why. gave it to me for free, I would use it, just like you did. Oh, wow. But I still don't feel like I can put value on this. That's going to get me okay. to drink more water. This is the strongest one. This is the strongest one. So you can taste that now. This one I'm tasting. This one I'm going to give. <clears throat> Hallelujah. This one I'm going to give 50%. 40-50%. This one, this one is strong. This one isn't in the background. I'll mm. be honest. All right. It's still weak, but it's not in the background. Yeah, I can taste it. Final one, Coca-Cola. When I smell it, do you know what it reminds me of? It reminds you of the vending machines. Those Coca Cola bottle sweets. Oh, the Harry Bow ones. Yeah, it doesn't. Yeah, well, anyone really. Um, yeah, yeah, even the Harry Bow ones because it doesn't smell like Coca Cola. It smells like cola, cola, gummy sweets. There's a difference. There's definitely cola. A difference. Smells so different. It smells like cola. You know that cola smell. It smells like cola. Yeah. Coca Cola. Not Coca Cola. Oh. Just normal cola. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah, like gummy, that cola. Yeah, Coca-Cola yeah. Cola yeah. bottle sweets. Yeah. You know the or the cheap Coca Cola that you buy if you don't want the original stuff. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. So, put that on. Lift. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. I was lifting it. Sorry, guys. You're tilting it. I was tilting it. Sorry, guys. No hands. <laughs> I can smell it already. This tastes like something. What that something is, I don't know, but it's definitely not cola. I would say it's probably as strong as the wild berry, but the difference is at least the wild berry tastes like wild berry, even though... I'm sorry, they're all weak, but Mm. the wild berry, I'd give it 50%, okay? This, I'd probably give it 50% too. But it doesn't taste like anything. Well, it tastes like something. I just don't know what that something is. Let me try. No tilting. That's impossible. I'm too small. (laughs) To me, it does taste like cola. Cat. But. Cat. Cat. I would say one thing. I prefer the other flavours. I think the other flavours work better. Which flavours are those? This strawberry lemongrass didn't that hits that was, the spot. Didn't think that was great. Winter apple for me. Didn't think that was great. Peach, I love it. Peach was in the background. And still. orange vanilla swirl. I don't think it's great, but I can see why people would want this because it's kind of nostalgic. Of it just gives you that kind of candy sweetness. Yeah. No, don't don't, yeah. don't don't let her lie to you. Don't let her deceive you, guys. I can't even taste anything, so I can taste. I can taste all of them. I can taste <laughs> all of them, and they're just weak. So, okay, I think I think what we can sum up is that clearly, it does work. Maybe I, you know, I it don't, I don't know. I mean, I mean, she says it works it for her, but, for but, 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 but hear, hear me out. Hear me out, guys. This was made as an alternative to war, right? Mm. So that, the, so that you don't get bored of war. War gets boring, you have something like this. Same concept as cordial, right? She said by her own mouth that she buys cordial, but she would never buy this. So that, that tells me, regardless of what she says, I think she's deceiving herself. No, but that, some people wait, don't want cordial. Wait, 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 there's wait, wait. still sugar in cordial. Yeah, I know there's sugar in cordial. But what my point is, mm. right, if the flavours are so exciting or whatever, you'd look past the fact that, oh, I have to buy this. You'd be like, okay, you know what? Maybe once in the balloon, I'll buy it. But you said, you categorically said you're not buying them when they're done. And you go through them slow. So that, and even the fact that you told me, <sighs> you, you lift it up and then when you're done, you push it down. I don't know why you're doing that, but whatever. You push it down and then you cover it. And then when you're drinking it, but, you, forget, you forget that the pod, you forget that it's been activated. That, that's a confirmation that is weak. 
if it was strong enough, then you would know as soon as you drink it, hang on, I haven't activated it, let me activate it. But you forget a lot. You, by your own admission, you said that. I said that because but the point I was trying to make is for someone like me who drinks water anyway, I don't have an issue drink, drinking water. Do I find water boring sometimes? Yes, I do. And if I want to switch it off, I would drink sparkling water. But if I want something completely diff, that's, you know, a little bit different, I would drink a cordial. I'll mix it with water. Exactly. But for me personally, I don't need these to get me to drink water. Some people, and yeah, obviously, but you don't need a cordial not, for you to drink water. But cordial is different. Why cordial's is it different? Sugar in it. No, it's Some the same. Some people want to avoid sugar. It's the same outright. concept. So for those people who. Still want a little bit of something Guys, with their water, but are not trying to get the calories in cordial. Then yes, why, they would why want, are we talking they, about they calories? Get this. Forget about the calories. Forget oh about the sugar. <laughs> He's just not getting it. Anyway, Do you guys anyway, get it? Anyway, Do you anyway. guys get what I'm saying? Do you know where I I'm think, coming from? I think we could be here all day arguing, I think debating. We could. I, I think I think ultimately what what we've established is that in terms of um, flavor profiles, we we know that. Different different flavors have different strengths. Mm. Um, I would say that the wild berry, the the lemon, mm. and the peach. Not necessarily saying they were the best because, like I said, for me they were all weak. And I think you had different favorites, but mm. I think peach was one of your favorites. Peach, but I think yeah. in terms of the strongest for me, in terms of um, strength of of that aroma uh, the hit when, when i was drinking it i would say these three mm. wild berry lemon and peach mm. so if these are flavors that you like and you feel like um air up does work for you maybe you already have an air up and you're thinking about different flavors maybe try these ones if you haven't already but um i think for a lot of people and i've seen reviews of other people reviewing the air up mm. i think for a lot of people it's not that they don't have a strong sense of smell because they do smell it i smell it mm. but it just doesn't seem to work Whereas for people like maybe you perhaps and mm. other people, in fact, maybe even other people even have a stronger smell, sense of smell, um, sen stronger sense of the flavors than you do. Because yeah. I've seen comments of people saying, oh, it's so yummy. It's so delicious. I loved it. And I'm thinking, really? <laughs> really? But yeah, I, I guess it's I think, just... Yeah, I think my take on it, guys, is like I said before, I enjoy using the water bottle because it keeps my water cool. I love the design, you know, um... I can carry it anywhere. It's not too heavy. Um, in terms of the flavors, there are some flavors that I like that are my favorites that you know I would I would choose. But for me personally, I don't have an issue with drinking pure water. You know, I don't. I can drink pure water in my sleep even. Like I'm just geared that way. I'm used to it. But I can see the appeal for other people that might find it harder to drink water on a regular basis and they would want a little something more you know and for those people i see that the air up would would be something that they would go to or choose and because it has a variety of flavors you know why not try the flavors um i wouldn't invest in the pods because it's something that is not worth investing in for me you know you put your money where where you see value so um, I would use the pods, you know, and I like the water bottle itself. And when the pods are done, I'm going to continue using the pod, the, the water bottle with or without the pods. So that's my take. Well, I was kind of using this bottle because it's superior <laughs> to that bottle. It's bigger, more capacity. But my bottle's sexy. Keeps it chilled. It's sexy. No, nah, I don't think so. I think it this is better. It looks so oh, oh, And that's another thing I think we didn't even address is the fact that with these water bottles, although they're good, it's it, it's kind of annoying that um, there's no way to like screwing it, this on. It can be a bit annoying mm. when you you know. I know that with you, sometimes on your travels, you just keep keep yeah, it off. Yeah, I never... just keep it off, which yeah. is a little bit. I have to admit, it's not. I wash my bo bo bottle like regularly though, but obviously for hygiene, it's better to put the cap on and lift it off. Sometimes it's you know I've seen water bottles that you just flick. You know, you flick to operate it like that. And I would feel that that's a better design because yeah. you don't need to take this off. Only you pitch. just, you know, go yeah. to your water bottle. Yeah, and this but, one yeah. and this one has other caps by the, as well, by the way, guys. So if I want to just drink it like that, I kind of have another cap for that. But anyway, um, I think we need to wrap this up because I can see that my camera is overheating. It's gonna die. No, it's not going to die. It's overheating. It's just, oh. just going to stop all oh, of a sudden. Dear. So, yeah. Um... That's going to be the end of this review. 
I really enjoyed this. I enjoyed this too. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. I think um, hopefully it's been helpful for you. If you guys want to comment down below, like, what's your take on the air up? Is it something you know that you've you have that you've used that you enjoy using? You know, are you thinking about getting one? Um, do you drink water regularly, or do you need a little bit of help with something like the air up? Let us know in the comments below. Peace. Bye.